Welcome back everybody, this is Oasis back with another video on the channel. Today's video is going to be about sightseeing. Now if you have a Samsung phone and you want to search for an app which will let you use your phone on the PC or on the Mac, then instead of looking for a third party application you should use this sightseeing application which is created by Samsung. Now what you can do with this app, we can mirror your phone screen to your PC or on a Mac. You can use your phone on the PC or on the Mac, transfer data, and there are so many other options available in this application. Well, this is created by Samsung, but not many people use it and not many people know about it. So that is why I decided to create a video, actually a tutorial, how to use this application. Now I have this Samsung phone here and I will just use this app to mirror this phone to my PC wirelessly you need to connect a PC and a phone on the same Wi-Fi so let's uh, download this application by clicking on this download for PC because I'm using PC and uh, you will see the installer double click on that click on next and next and you know how to install application in PC now once you install the application I've actually installed that already so I will just turn it on and uh, yeah, you will see sightseeing will pop up here. So this is a very small kind of interface. And now it's actually searching for the phone. Now what I'm gonna do, I'm actually going to start my phone and I need to install the sightseeing on the phone as well. You go to the Play Store, search for sightseeing created by Samsung and you will see the same icon in the Play Store. Now let's start that application. I'm just gonna start that. And as you can see here, we got that same kind of thing. And now I'm able to see that desktop there and then it's connecting to the phone. Now I got all my notification now and uh, I can see the screen on the PC as well. Now my phone screen turned to black because it knows that we are connected to the PC. Now I'm actually going to use the phone uh, from the PC. Now as you can see that we got this uh, icon change for the cursor. I can just scroll to the left, scroll to the right, and I can even start any kind of application which is installed on my Samsung phone, and I can use that on PC. Now, this is one and only application which will let you do all these things with your Samsung phone. All of the third-party application which will mirror your phone to the PC, but you won't be able to use the phone. Only this application will let you do that. Now, let's say I wanna see the notification. I can click here, and I can see the notification here. I can go to the browser, I can open the Play Store. Let me show you how you can search for a side sync. So you just click here. Now I'm using a keyboard on the PC. I'm not using the mobile at all. So this is my phone, fully black, turned off, and I just put it here. Now I will search for side sync. And then there you go. I've already installed that application and I opened that before, right? As you can see, uh, it's already connected to the PC, so that's why we're getting this message. I'm going to click on this home button, and you can see that we can use our phone completely, and we can record our screencasting like I'm doing right now. I'm recording this by Camtasia, and I'm using the phone on the PC. Now, all the phone features are available here, so it's a complete phone on your PC. There's a few other things that you can do. You can clear your notification in this application. So this is a screencast of your phone and this is a side sync application. Now if I click on this phone screen, it will turn off the screen and now my phone is back on. Now if I click on this home screen button, it will make my phone black and then my phone will come to the PC. Now there's other option as well, like, uh, like you can see here, we have a drag and drop files to share them. Now let's say I will drag this file and I just drop it here. Now it will automatically be copied to my phone and I can find that in the files like here if I go to the, my files and it should show me that the transferred file. So it should be in the documents or somewhere. Yeah, there you go. This is the file I just transferred 3rd May to 14 AM. Now as you can see that you can transfer uh, files vice versa which is really cool and it's really fast. It's connected to Wi-Fi and you can transfer all the big data. Like if you wanna download your photos or videos, you don't have to go look for your USB or you know you can just uh, take out your SD card and put it in your PC and then transfer your data. You can do it wirelessly. Now this application is only available for Samsung phone because it's created by Samsung. It's a one-only app 
Uh, there's a few other things you can do here. You can see this plus icon here, click on this, and then you will find all your application installed in your uh, phone. Let's say we will have this Adobe Clip. I'm gonna click on this add, and then I can see that here. Now, instead of just going to the phone, I can start this application by clicking on this instead of just finding that on my phone. Also, I'm gonna click on this uh, home button. It will start the music. Now it's pretty cool, try it out and yeah if you like the video smash the like button and let me know in the comments below if you want to see more videos like uh, on Android tutorials. Alright so I'll see you guys in the next one, cheers.